Hello again. My name's Bruce Clow. I keep bees and work at Cirrusel Beekeeping Supplies. Well, today we're going to look at removing honey supers from the hive so we can take them in and extract that uh, golden reward that we've been looking for. So we'll just start getting everything ready. I always like to have a smoker handy. You never know how the bees are gonna react when we start pulling their stores off the hive. So we've got our smoker all organized and we'll kit up. And here you can see the super stand that we're gonna use. It comes in three varieties. The one that I have here is the tilt box stand, but it comes in the classic stand where there's no moving parts. And then for the beekeepers that want to save a lot of space on their truck, there's a collapsible stand. It sits so that the slide will drop the bees right to the entrance of the hive. So we're not gonna blow the bees so that they fill the atmosphere around the hive. Now we're gonna be using a bee blower. Um, might not be the right thing for everyone. Um, a lot of people would use bee escapes and I did myself for many years. Um, but the nice thing about a bee blower is that not only does it quickly remove the bees from the frames in the honey super, it also chills the bees so that they'll be a little bit dopey for a while and it gives us an opportunity to get that box clean of the bees and hidden away uh, before the bees really know what's happening. So here we are, we're loading that onto our super stand tilt tray and we have our cordless uh, bee blower. This is a nice little product that if you have a few hives um, should do the job. If you got quite a few, you might want a, uh, a petrol driven blower, but this one's just fine for a few hives. So we'll just try to clean all the bees out with a good blast of air. And they're being thrown onto the slide and dropping down to the entrance of the hive. You can see we're not filling the air with bees. Okay, the bees gone. We quickly shift it to the wheelbarrow and we'll just cover it up so that uh, we minimize the, the smell of honey in the environment. So there we are, we've got a super off and we can take that to the honey house. We'll just clean up the stand, blow those dopey bees down by the entrance so when they wake up they'll just crawl back inside. And then of course we could uh, remove that queen excluder or put another honey super on top if we like. There we go.